Let's go now. A five minute blitz match. Zero increment. See how we crack on. Okay, let's just take. Let's attack the queen. Develop. Hmm, interesting times. Let's just um, get king safety. Okay, castle. Happy with the little pawn pushes at the moment. But it could be like a sleeping tiger. Night out. <laughs> okay, let's uh, open up the dark square bishop. Let's try and manage a bit of air space. Okay, it's going for Fiancetto type stuff. Okay, nice little weaky pawn. Maybe we can sort of swing the bishop here to get the queen here. Maybe attack this pawn. Let's go here if they castle. He's not castling, he's seen this before. He has been here before, so he's getting rid of our dark square bishop. Okay, let's change track. Right, so we can bring the knight up here. What's it really attacking at the minute? It's attacking the weak pawn, but the bishop's protecting it at the moment. So what have they got? They've got this. We have this rook facing the queen. So if it kicks off, we can get the queen off the board. Obviously it's going castling. It's not castle just yet. Okay, so how do we want to work this? White square bishop's not really active at the moment. Maybe doubling up the rooks just to just for something to do. Okay, let's double the rooks because he's not moved his queen. Still have the power base focusing through. So he's moved his knight. So his knight is potentially looking to attack the queen, but we have protection at the moment. Is he looking to jump here? To attack the queen probably so because our queen looks a little bit jammed in but we'll continue because we still have the power base here so he has gone and castled so we're still opposite his queen i'm chomping at the bit to punch here but he's got the knight he's got the bishop he's got the pawn he's got the queen we don't have that many pieces there we do have a space for the knight to jump in here which is a bit annoying for the opponent it's just that it's not really attacking anything is it it's just there. Hmm. I'm going to bring it through because being just there, maybe we can attack his bishop with the support from the knight. I don't think he's going to let us get that off. The knight's going to be doing something. Maybe going for an exchange. It's not going for the exchange. I'm going to attack the bishop see what actually happens there he does have a little bit of a post here that he can sit on it's obviously got this he's not done that just yet but uh, we'll go here so he's attacking the queen we'll take here pawn's going to be on our knight knight can attack his rook but um, not really because the queen will take so I've got to look. Maybe we bring the knight here again. Could go there, but it feels like it's going backwards. If we go here, maybe the bishop takes. I doubt it very much. So the pawn will drop down onto it, but then we'd be able to take this pawn here. So let's do that. He might do a knee jerk reaction. Nope, he's thinking. Right, my time's running down to 237 there on 255, so we need to just... He's not doing that move now. Let's <coughs> bring this rook into the game. So looking to get across here. What's my knight got? Knight, 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 knight. 
and doo -doo -doo -doo. now our rooks are just facing the queen but there's no way of getting rid of our pawn at the moment so maybe the knight coming here putting pressure onto the pawn let's bring the knight here kind of two on one situation obviously he pushes down onto it he doesn't he's attacking our queen okay we can move here but then his pawn drops onto us can move there it drops his pawn drop back or do we just go here anyway could attack his pawn let's attack the unprotected pawn we're on 1 minute 37, oh it's not a long play game dude come on, gonna have to move swift uh, so he's moved, uh, just take this I suppose his rook just comes and faces us now and gets this pawn doesn't do that just yet, he's attacking our knight true, could bring the knight across attacking this pawn so if the rook comes in we can take the pawn with the queen Time's running down. Time is running down. And picture that, yeah. So we'll take here. It's gonna get that pawn anyway. It's not gone for the exchange. Uh, can we take there? No. Um, due to purpose, let's maybe go across again. Be a bit annoying. Opposite the king. How many pieces has he got on there? He's got about 50 million on there, hasn't he? Yeah, damn. Bishop's taking the pawn. Or even the rook. It's not doing that either. Gee, right, okay. Let's support this pawn for now. And he's got an extra through to our knight. Okay, good shot. Could take here, but I've got to remember that the queen is protecting there. Does take, let's grab. Oh, it's all kicking off now. 146 they're on, it's just challenging me, just challenging me. I'm trying to squeeze my queen back down here again. Oh, he's not having it. Uh, he's not having it. Oh, he's not having it, I'm going to run out of time here. I'm going to have to squeeze it here. 43 seconds. Damn, bullet time. They seem to be taking a lot longer than me, but their time is not going down. It's like one, one minute they're on still. One minute and six, one minute and five. Just got a picture of his queen coming here, squishing my king. That's gonna hurt. Oh, they're on 42 seconds now. Pawns down. Da -da. supports doesn't support um i need to get my queen across the other side of the board i'm in panic mode now twenty five seconds they're on we're on thirty four sixteen seconds they're on oh we might do it oh it's Pressuring. Uh, queen. Do the queen, do the queen, do the queen. Let's attack his queen. Seven seconds they've got. I think we might. Ooh, what's happening here? He's attacking my pawn down the bottom. Do we give it to him? No. Four seconds they've got. 
zero seconds. Oh, and we won on time. Excellent. I'm quite happy with that because positionally it did, it looks okay. It wasn't like one of those where it looked a bit shocking, but let's see what the gauge bar is saying. We're here, yeah, yeah. So we've got quite a few pawns here to work with if it was going to go into the real end game of the situation, yeah. Really quite happy with the movement of that and obviously I wanted to get my queen back over again, helping to support my king. Don't want my king feeling home alone. So that was quite an interesting game. Just gonna go through it just to make sure. So capture, captured. I think the opponent played really quite stalwartly. You know, they were, I don't think they made any massive big errors, I don't think really. Um, weren't happy with this type of situation, but it we didn't really take the advantage of it because they blocked it off. So we tapped the knight and then they got rid of the bishop that was potentially being, you know, focused on this pawn. So that was a good shot. And then we wanted to be opposite the queen, just in case anything kicked off. But then somehow that area ten, um, ended up being locked down. Doesn't like our bishop type exchange thing going on, saying it's a draw. So capture, 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 capture. We're just trying to reposition as best possible. So they're attacking our queen, we're attacking un undefended pieces. Capture. And again, just jostling, taking advantage of the two on ones in that situation as well. So that was quite nice, felt good. But there was nothing to target. So now, basically, my rooks, even though they're facing through here, there's no avenue really for them. It, wait, we're plus 3.8, so that's good. That's good. My queen is being a bit overworked and it's almost like now I'm being trapped out of the situation but it's showing plus 5.1 here so I can't really grumble. And then we're trying to get our queen back over because our king is home alone. It's just that the opponent hasn't put any pressure towards that area just yet. So that's when we try to change tack and reposition and yeah, fairly comfortable with that. Nice game.